You have created amazing content that provides value to your audience and showcases your expertise. But how do you make sure that your content reaches the right people at the right time? How do you amplify your content marketing efforts and generate more leads and sales? In this section, we will discuss how to distribute and promote your content across different channels and platforms. The first step is to identify your target audience and their preferred channels. You need to know who you are creating content for, what their pain points are, what their goals are, and where they spend their time online. This will help you tailor your content to their needs and interests, and choose the best platforms to reach them. The second step is to create a content distribution plan. This is a document that outlines your content goals, your distribution channels, your budget, your timeline, and your metrics. A content distribution plan will help you stay organized and consistent, and measure your results. You can use tools like Google Sheets or Trello to create your plan. The third step is to optimize your content for each channel. Different channels have different requirements and best practices for content. For example, you need to use keywords and hashtags for SEO and social media, create catchy headlines and thumbnails for YouTube, write engaging captions and stories for Instagram, use email subject lines and CTAs that drive action, etc. You also need to consider the format and length of your content for each channel. For example, you can repurpose a blog post into a video, a podcast, an infographic, a slide deck, etc. The fourth step is to schedule and automate your content distribution. You don't want to spend all your time manually posting and sharing your content. You want to use tools that can help you save time and reach more people. For example, you can use tools like Buffer or Hootsuite to schedule your social media posts in advance, use tools like MailChimp or ConvertKit to automate your email campaigns, use tools like Zapier or Ift to connect different platforms and automate tasks, etc. The fifth step is to engage with your audience and influencers. You don't want to just push your content out there and hope for the best. You want to interact with your audience and build relationships with them. You want to respond to their comments and questions, ask for their feedback and opinions, thank them for their support, etc. You also want to reach out to influencers in your niche who have a large and loyal following. You want to collaborate with them, share their content, mention them in your content, etc. The sixth step is to analyze and optimize your content distribution. You want to track and measure the performance of your content across different channels and platforms. You want to use tools like Google Analytics or Facebook Insights to see how many views, clicks, shares, likes, comments, etc. Your content generates. You also want to use tools like Buzzsumo or SEMrush to see how your content ranks for keywords and topics, how it compares to your competitors' content, etc. Based on the data, you want to identify what works well and what needs improvement. You want to test different variables like headlines, images, CTAs, etc. And optimize your content accordingly. These are the six steps that will help you distribute and promote your content across different channels and platforms. By following these steps, you will be able to reach more customers with killer content marketing strategies.